In today's video, you're gonna learn a really cool rubber band trick that you can do at home, at school, at the office, anywhere you go. Just carry a couple rubber bands and you'll be able to do this trick. That's coming up right after this. Well, hey there, my friends. Thanks for stopping by for another episode here at Presto Paul TV. If we have not met before, I'm your host, Presto Paul. And on this channel, I teach you the best tricks, tips, and techniques on how to do magic for beginners. And we're gonna have some fun. There's a motto right over there. If you have not heard this before or have not said this before, I want you to say it loud, say it proud. You gotta have fun, you'll live longer. So you are in luck today. I have a special mysterious guest that's gonna be coming on camera with me uh, to show you the performance of this video. And that's coming up right now. Sit back and relax. Enjoy the antics of my little friend. So all you need for this trick is a couple of rubber bands. These are ordinary rubber bands. But to make sure I have my mysterious guest, Miss Hand over here that's gonna examine these rubber bands to make sure they're exactly what they appear to be. No gaps, no holes, no Velcro, hidden assistance, or anything like that. Do those look perfectly fine for you? Did you notice any holes inside of them besides that big one right there in the middle? <laughs> no, okay. So now what I'm gonna have her do is you're gonna take this rubber bands and I'm gonna have you pinch the middle two strands, so this yellow one and the white one in the center, and we're going to attempt to link these bands together. I want you to see by all sides that it's perfectly normal. Everything looks great, great right there. So go ahead and pinch those middle two strands for me. Give them a little bit of a knead like on some dough and on three, two, one, let go. Look at there, <laughs> totally locked together. Check that out, that is cool. Now we're gonna do it again, but we're gonna do it backwards. So just take your hand out there and pinch that middle spot together and go ahead and give it a little bit of a rub right there. And on three, two, <laughs> one, right on cue, just like we practiced and you come apart just like that. Find out how to do this fun <laughs> trick. <laughs> right now <laughs> i hope you like that performance with my mysterious volunteer as you can see it's a fun little trick to do and sometimes things go wrong during a performance don't worry about that just ad lib i do this all the time you never know what your audience member is going to say or do or if you make a mistake and how to get through it you just have to ad lib move on have fun because you'll live longer so let me show you this from uh, the front again one more time without a volunteer. If you don't have a volunteer to help you, you could do this yourself. I'm gonna show you the setup here in just a second. Uh, you, all you would do in lieu of their hand is you're just gonna rub with your fingers right there and they will link in the middle and you can unlink over here on this side. So let's get back behind the table and see from my point of view how to get ready to perform this fun little trick. All right, all you need for this trick are a couple of rubber bands. You could find these just about anywhere, office supplies, grocery stores, Walmart. You wanna have some that are two different colors. It makes the trick a little bit more impressive when they could see that link in the middle with the two colors intersecting each other. Uh, so to get set up for this, you're gonna take your index finger and put one over there, your pinky over there, and you're just gonna mirror that image on the other side and you are just about there. Now you can see this looks very familiar because this is exactly what it looks like during the performance. This is the beauty of this trick. It is so clean. You can see all sides and won't see the dirty work that's gonna be behind these two fingers, which you're gonna get that set up by taking the second strand from the top. You're gonna take your thumbs and push them down past the middle one, just like this. And now you're gonna take your ring finger and put it inside there and grab a hold of it. So you can see right there where it's linked. Now you're gonna get your other fingers in this gap here. So you're just gonna reach over and you're gonna grab those two fingers and put it in there. You slide it back. Now we have a mirror image. Look at that. It looks just like it did in the performance. You can see all sides perfectly clean, except for now we have this little dirty part right there. So look at that, see where that looks like and see what that looks like right there. To perform the trick by having somebody put the middle two strands together, that's one way to do it. If you do it by yourself, all you're gonna do is this is gonna release off your ring finger as you reach up to kind of knead these together with your thumb and middle finger. It's already off of there and it's already just ready for me to reveal that they are linked. So that's what it looks like when it's linked. You can definitely see right there in the middle, it's totally hooked up. Now we have one more link to unlink here. This one's clean now. Same thing's gonna happen. You're gonna reach forward and it's just gonna slide right off of there. It's already unlinked. I'm just milking this at this point. And then you let go and they unlink. So when you do the get ready, you come down, put your ring finger in, reach over, pull the other ones down, and you are good to go. 
you're already set with the link over here and the link over here. That's if you just let go of your fingers, just like that, they unsnap. Let me do it slow one more time for you. Just like that, goes in there. I'm already linked on that side. Reach over, grab in there, and you're set to go. Have a spectator or you need the uh, rubber bands in the middle, and then need them over here to get them to unconnect, just like that. You could hand these out for inspection. Nothing to see, nothing to worry about. An awesome trick. Have a blast performing this one, my friends. Well, I hope you take the time to practice this really fun trick. Audiences love this trick, especially when it happens right between their finger. That's strong magic for someone watching what you're doing. Takes a few seconds to get into this in the beginning. Once you practice that get ready, you'll be able to do it without even knowing that you're doing it. Just pretend like you're fiddling with the rubber bands and come out and present it. If you wanna just get ready beforehand and do that, you can already have it set, walk into your room where your friends are and present the trick just like that as well. Hey, if you're liking what you see here, give me a big thumbs up. If you wanna see some more videos with rubber band magic, leave me a comment down below or any questions that you have about this video as well. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I hope you would consider doing that. Until next week, I'm your host, Presto Paul. And remember, you gotta have fun. You'll live longer. <laughs> Stop copying me. Stop copying me. Stop copying me.